I grew up in Queens, New York, the most multicultural community in the world. My mother is from Norway. My father was from the Dominican Republic. So multiculturalism, multiplicity, um, a sort of fusion of different autobiographical factors very much influences the work that I make. And it also, of course, impacts the way that I teach. So my work is very much rooted uh, in making connections. And that lies within, for me, the discourse around drawing. That drawing connections, making constellations between meanings, associations, and histories, that drawing is this democratic, really foundational way of thinking and way of making that brings that all together. I received my MFA from the University of Florida. And while I was here, my work was very much tethered to my autobiography. So I was turning to photographic references of family members and oral history of my family members from the Dominican Republic and from Norway and finding a way of visualizing those connections uh, for the viewer. I think my work has really expanded in terms of the collaborative approach that I undertake with my sister, Janelle Iglesias. We've been collaborating since around 2005, and we collaborate still to this day. It's this really strong, rigorous pathway in both of our practices so that we maintain our individual studio work and our individual object-making practices. But we always put time aside and invest in continuing and nurturing the ideas that come up between each other. There is a lot of crossover between my role as educator and my role as an artist. And I'm a student in both of those realms. The kind of curiosities and interests that my students bring into the classroom oftentimes get played out in my own studio independently after class hours as well. I worked very hard at the very beginning of the semester to deliberately construct an environment where students feel safe and where they feel that this is an inclusive environment where their opinions, their backgrounds, their conflicts, their anxieties are welcome. And that art making is a site for, yes, making connections, but also revealing disruptions and uh, we're static. And that those kind of difficult conversations are welcome and are encouraged in our classroom. And I think that both the role of an artist and the role of an educator are roles of privilege and roles of, of responsibility. So in both of these identities, I want to deliberately bring to that position an acknowledgement that I'm amplifying histories or that I'm reinforcing ideas, that I'm introducing techniques, introducing histories, introducing people to my students and to the people who interact with my artwork.